everybody, this is uh, Captain Murray Bowyer, retired, coming to you from uh, scenic New Hampshire. It's uh, about 15 degrees outside here in January, and I'm sure wherever you are, you're probably warmer, but be that as it may, um, I just had a few uh, experiences about uh, my uh, military career that I'd like to share with you and see if any of this resonates with you. Um, I, uh, I didn't know what I want to do for a living, and my dad, who was in the Army 20 years, uh, said, son, if you don't know what you want to do, join the Army. So I thought, you know, that ended up to be pretty good advice. I uh, went to ROTC and incurred a four-year commitment in the military right after I graduated. I ended up going five years in, in the Army. And uh, while I was in the Army, I noticed, you know, this is something you might be able to relate to, that uh, uh, it was difficult for the spouse of the, of the uh, service member a lot of stress. I mean, you're you're subject to the conditions or wherever the assignment is, and you have to move around, and you can't really dedicate yourself. At least when I was in the military, this is in the 80s. You know, there was no internet, so it was very difficult for the non-service member spouse. And as a result, I held off getting married uh, until after I got out of the army. So, uh, and I I know that can be real tough uh, on families. Um, and um, when I decided to leave the military and, and get a civilian career, uh, I, you know, I wondered if my skills would translate to, to the civilian life, to the civilian world. And when you're in the military, as you probably well know, it's, it's kind of an insulated world. It's like its own economy. You're, it's like its own universe. It's 24-7 where you're relying on other people for you know, survival. You're relying on teamwork. You're 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 getting promoted based on you're getting compensated and promoted based on your contribution. Uh, for the most part, everyone's rowing in the same direction, and, and uh, you know th there's life or death decisions on the line, and you have to take responsibility for your actions. Now, when you get to the civilian world, it's dog eat dog, and uh, it's a big shock, big shock. Uh, to me, in my mind, it's a lot more political. Um, it, you don't necessarily get compensated for your contribution. You could, uh, you know, I, in my case, I, I, I know I do a lot more than the people I work with by orders of magnitude, but I'm not willing to kiss ass, and uh, I'm not political at all, as you can tell, and therefore I don't, uh, I don't march up the ladder. I think I'm probably, my career is probably capped out. I work as the, at a Fortune 500 uh, company. I'm a financial executive. So it's a different world, you know, it's a different world. H having said that, uh, in my opinion, uh, not, not in my opinion, I know that you have the right skills in the military uh, to do well. you just got to wrap your mind around it and, and find something where you can, where you can take advantage of your uh, initiative, your willing to, uh, your, your uh, following orders, following your discipline, your take charge attitude, your ability to take responsibility, uh, your uh, trainability, your camaraderie, uh, those will all do you very well in the civilian world where a lot of those skills are lacking. Uh, I, in the last two or three years I've been looking for something to supplement my income with a home-based job because uh, you know if, you're, if your salary isn't increasing at least six percent a year you're not catching up with inflation you are losing money and my salary is not in increasing by six percent a year so uh, I've been looking for a part-time job. I've struck out on a few occasions. There's a lot of crap out there, but uh, I am incredibly fortunate. I wanted to share this with you because I think it's very important that uh, if you are in the military or ex-military or a military spouse, that this is something that, that you ought to look into because it's something you can, you can do from home. Uh, all you need is the internet and the computer. You, uh, no special skills required. It's almost a business in a box. It's a foolproof system. An amazing there's nothing else like it, and uh, the the people who are in who are work in this business. This is a, this is a business. Uh, the camaraderie is unbelievable. I have never seen such uh, willingness to help others. Everyone is sharing in, in the uh, in their gains, and to the fact where it's it's, it's beyond money. It's um, this is about life. Uh, once you get your purpose in life. Once you determine what direction you want to go, and you have to decide that. But once that becomes ingrained in you, this system is the key to unlocking the door to your future. Um, I've never seen 
there's people from all walks of life. I've never seen such broad success. Uh, income, you know, income earnings do vary. There's a disclaimer. Uh, the, you know, depending on your skills and your how much you put into it, everyone's not going to make millions of dollars. But uh, you can get very well rewarded uh, for you know some decent amount of work with this system, with these tools. It's very repeatable. It's very uh, it's very doable if you're willing to put in the work. And it's something that you need to take a look at. I think uh, I can't recommend it highly enough, particularly anyone of a military background. Uh, I think it's a uh, it's a great opportunity. Uh, I strongly recommend it. I'm doing everything I can to expose as many people, friends, people I, you know, that I respect. Uh, even if they have businesses already, this can really help supercharge them. Um, I'm trying to expose this opportunity to as many people as possible because I, you know, I want to help people out, and that's what my purpose is. So I, I hope this has been of value. I appreciate you listening, and I encourage you to check further, check this out a lot further, and. Uh, I wish you luck, and most importantly, I, I want to thank you for your service to the country.